video. I'm just trying out a setup for Thursday. Um, I'm going to be doing live Instagram on my Dodger and Jack Instagram account. I'm going to do a live bonding session around 10 Eastern Standard Time. And so I'm just trying out my own little setup here. <laughs> I think it'll work, and it took a little fiddling around, hopefully, <laughs> and doesn't fall over. Um, so yeah, we're back in the crate. We had to do a little bit of sink time for a couple of days, and they settled down. <clears throat> um, we had a little bit of nipping yesterday, but um, it settled down really quick. Dodger's just really scared of any sudden movements or... Um, you know, if somebody comes by and starts talking to me or something, or just kind of any kind of change. I think he, I think one of the times he jumped up and started getting nippy was when my alarm went off <clears throat> for one of my medications. Like, he's heard this, like, alarm, like, a billion times, but for some reason he just, you know, in here with Jack, he's, really, he's you know, after the, uh, after the floor time session, he's just, he's just, taking him some time to sort of trust Jack again, but Jack's been really good, um, trying to help him out, I know, buddy, I plucked your foof, I plucked this foof too, okay, that one came loose really easily, um, so Jack, Jack's been trying really hard to get him to relax, and, um, he, Jack just needs to work on that, um, sort of attacking back when Dodger sort of lunges at him a little bit. But, you know, it's hard when you're not sure, when you're not sure what's going on, isn't that, buddy? Yeah, you're not sure. You're not sure either. I know. You never know who's gonna bite ya. Who's just, you know, making gestures. <clears throat> so, um, I think I'm gonna do this today and tomorrow, and then I think my plan was, I don't know, I wrote it down somewhere. My plan was on Wednesday, I think. It's either tomorrow or Wednesday, um, to move this crate, uh, the grate, not the crate, the cr grate back another two slots. And then, um, we'll just do that every, oh, you're okay. Are you okay? Did I scare you? <laughs> I don't know what I just did that scared you. I think you got scared. So, um... I think my plan was to do that sort of every two days. So give them two days to get used to it and then move it back again. And then two days to get used to it and move it back. And then um, probably when we're, you know, closer to the end, I'll just take it out all together instead of keep moving it. Because I think it'll only be like, oh, see. He just gets, yeah. Yeah, you get a little nervous when you, you, you're not expecting him to move. But he's allowed to move, Bubba. Okay? He's okay. He just wants to get comfortable. Hmm? You can get comfortable. He's so grumpy today. He's been, like, grumpy every morning. I don't think mornings are his thing, but... Um, I'm just trying to get them into it because it's so much cooler in the morning. And then I think I want to try it. If, when it's cool at night, just do two sessions, so one in the morning if it's cool, and one at night if it's cool. So, it'll, it'll be two sessions, and I'm just slowly working them back up to, to, um, their two, three hour sessions, because they haven't been able to tolerate much. No. No, that's okay, though. We'll get you used to it again. So we're only doing about like an hour, hour and a half. I think we did an hour and a half yesterday. And then I just decided to <clears throat> leave it there. Because I, that was after I got them calmed down. He's probably going to get grumpy with me here. Um, after I got them calmed down. And then a little squabble. And I just let them rest. For, I don't know. I think it was probably like that. That was probably the extra half hour. Because <clears throat> I was going to take them out at an hour. And then. Um, we got 15-20 minutes. Before I was ready to take them out. They got in a 
squabble. Yeah. So I just left them in for a little bit longer. So, um, that's my plan. Um, I might add some pictures to, um, <clears throat> our Facebook page. Um, about some future plans. You know, once we, I think it'll be <clears throat> somewhere the 3rd of August that I'm hoping to have this whole crate open. And then, so I'll put up some plans about what's going to happen after that. Because some, somebody in the House Rabbits group shared a little makeshift thing that she came up with. And so I think I'm going to try that. Because I would like to use the bathroom, but um, they also, I think, will need a place in here to run around a little bit. Have a little space to stretch so they're not... Because there's going to be, you know... <laughs> I don't know. At some point, we'll have to introduce a litter box, and um, so it'll take up a good amount of space. So I don't want them to have a space to get a little bit of stretching. So I'll share that on Facebook. Um, but that'll be, you know, future future thing. <laughs> but I just wanted to share it for anybody else who's looking for ideas for um, temporary arrangements as they get their rabbits used to um, playing together and being a bond to pair together and expanding um, territory for them. So, yep, um, I probably won't update again until, um, well, I may do it when I expand this out, but otherwise it won't be until probably after Thursday. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Adios. <laughs> it's too dark in here to see. So we did have a little setback. We got in a fight. So I've made the crate um, back to the small size again. We did do a short sink, se sink session. So, um... Yeah, we'll just, we'll just see how it goes. I guess I'm not gonna dodge it. Those aren't yours. See, this is what he does. He tries to grab his Jack Jack secret tropes. So, I don't think we're gonna expand the pen probably on Wednesday. Um, we're just gonna slowly work our way back to where we were, I think. We'll see how it goes, though. So, I gotta get back to it. <laughs>